Hey, it's Philip from Pacific Coast, and we're doing the final video here. We're doing a generator startup on the boat. We're on shore power right now. Whenever I start a generator, I turn the switch to the generator. We've got it loaded. We're going to hold the preheat for a second, for about 20 seconds or so, and then we're going to give it a startup. Just holding on to it for a few minutes while we hit the preheat. The generators do require to be preheated, the main engines on this boat. They fired up with no preheat. Fire, you know, the preheat helps for sure, but these things are so strong and solid, they fired in the first second or two when I turned the keys on the main engine. So here we go, I'm gonna, I'm gonna fire it up. I gotta put my camera down because I need to use two hands. There we go. Dead cold start on the generator. And as you can see, it's now cranking out 120. That's dead cold, hasn't been running about two or three months and it fired up right away. We're gonna go out the back here, take a look at the exhaust again. I'm not sure where it comes out on this boat. It's coming out there, you, you don't even know it really. Um, it's coming out on the, the port side. Let's see if I can see it better over here. Just under the swim grid, but yeah, there's no smoke either. Fired right up. Generators always crank a few mi a little longer than the mains on these boats. Nothing abnormal at all. So that's our generator startup. It's putting out power. The boat has got lots of switches on. The big one being, you know, um, you know, you can load it up. A hot water tank is on, so that's a big load on those things. So it's doing exactly what it's supposed to do. Generator startup on a 3888 Bayliner motor yacht. Thanks again for watching.